Hey y'all, today we are talking about how to be the most interesting conversationalist in the room. And this is for any situation, whether you're going on a first date or brunch with friends or to a conference or networking event, etc. This is for any situation, particularly if you just feel like you don't always know how to carry conversations or you feel like you don't know how to cultivate conversation with strangers. Okay, so step one actually starts before you ever open your mouth. People are highly narcissistic and most people in their day-to-day -day lives don't have a forum or opportunity to talk at abandon about their vacation, their lives, their kids, their job, etc. Normally they're keeping these like very short scripts. So the first key is to provide a space for people to sort of just lose themselves in conversation. And what you wanna do as they're sort of talking ad nauseum about whatever, sort of see where their eyes light up or maybe they provide additional detail about something. You can probably tell, okay, this is something that's really important to them and then ask more questions about that. And like, oh my God, that's so interesting. Can you tell me more? So don't think so much about, oh my God, what am I gonna say next? Instead, just sort of like pull on the strings that they give you. Okay, now it's your turn to talk. What do you say? Hands down, the people who are the best conversationalists, public speakers, etc., are very good storytellers. Like they just know how to cultivate a story out of like benign things, or they're very good at like slightly embellishing or like grandiosifying whatever they're going through in their life. And it allows, I'll give you an example. So for example, I could easily say when someone asked me, so what do you do for work? Oh, I'm the head of XYZ department at XYZ company. That's flat, that doesn't really give an opportunity for conversation. Instead, now you can say, you know what, I've always been so passionate about women and underrepresented folks um, ever since I was growing up as a young child where I didn't have a ton of representation in my city. So I started and built a career off of that. And right now I'm currently the head of diversity at XYZ Company and I've been doing that for the past five years and I'm extremely passionate about it. That story now gives people so much to pull on, right? They can talk about where you grew up, how you got passionate about this particular industry, how you got this role, etc. There's so much more opportunity for conversation when you introduce yourself like that. And not only is it more opportunity for conversation, but they also know what you're passionate about. So you, they can do the work of introducing you to someone else in the room. Next, you wanna offer a touch of vulnerability. When you offer vulnerability, that kind of automatically creates a safe space and a temporal sense of intimacy between whoever you're speaking with that also allows them to share something. Like they feel like they just got a little gift or peek inside your life. So you wanna walk into every room with a few stories in your back pocket, depending on the situation. So if you're going to a networking event, how did you get into tech or this particular industry? What do you do now, etc. Those are some stories that you can begin to cultivate off of the questions that you can anticipate. Same thing with dates, with friends, with brunches. Think about your week or where you are in your life and begin to cultivate stories that are captivating. And then lastly, if you're going on like, particularly like if you're going to a networking event or something formal, you want to one, anticipate the questions that you're going to get. So at a tech mixer, you're probably gonna get questions around like, what do you do? Why are you interested in tech? Anticipate those questions and have an answer for them. Another pro tip is your unique value proposition or UVP. What is the one thing that makes you extraordinary, interesting, compelling, etc.? What is the one skill, thing that you know, etc., that you can teach anyone in the room about or a piece of information that will make the conversation more interesting? I hope this helps.